Say hello. Oh. Hi. Hi. Okay. <laughs> I've got a little helper today. Haven't you I? Want them to be on you want to pretend to be a zombie on it? Yeah. I don't think we'll pretend to be a zombie on it. Yeah, it's very funny. Yeah. Hi and welcome to my vlog part two. Now I've changed things up a bit because I was really really sick last week and I know this is coming out a little later than it should because I should have came out a couple of days after my first vlog part one and I was going to do a room tour and some making hot chocolate, just some things, Leon playing games etc but I was really really ill last week and I didn't have a chance to finish it all and put it all together and I decided well I'm just going to make a new vlog part two all together so things are a little bit different because um well I was sick I did get a few things in the post that I'm really excited about and I really want to just talk to you about it just show you what I got some blogger mail some boots I bought that I absolutely love they are amazing and I just wanted to get this done before I go out tonight Um I did have better light today and I was trying to get this done when I did have a lot of natural light but as you'll have seen, Leon was not letting that happen. He was just, you know, he would want to be in the video, he wanted to play zombies, he wanted to show everybody everything, which is super cute. And I've just left a couple of things in as like a blooper reel type thing. But yeah, um, so yeah, this is my vlog part two. Okay, so I wanted to start off with a little blogger present that I got from Claudia from the Girls Day Out show. And yeah, I got this little letter. And it's just a little extra present before the show starts on the 2nd of December until the 4th of December at Glasgow SECC. And this is like the press thing. So I got a little present which I'm, I was really really surprised by and it was really really nice of her to send. And I got some gin. I don't know if you can see it. Oh no, it's not working. Can you see it? Why is this not focusing? Oh dear. Please focus. Okay, it's not really focusing. Anyway, I got some gin. Packerings gin. And it came with a little leaflet about the gin. And this. And a little, it's a little postcard from them writing on the back. And I was excited. And I don't actually like gin. But I'm sure I have somebody in my life that does. And they will enjoy this. But it was a lovely little present to receive nonetheless. I also received a little scent wax melt from Flamingo Candles and this, I absolutely love Flamingo Candles, their Parma Violet one is the best smelling thing I've ever smelled in my life. And this is a rose scent melt, it's lovely and I'm probably going to give this one to my grand to put down stairs in the living room wax melt um, burner because she loves rose scent and I like rose scent and that way it will spread throughout the house rather than just being confined to my room. So that was a little nice present I got from the from Claudia at Girls Day Out, so thank you for that. That was so sweet to get in the post and it really cheered me up. I also in the post this week, what did I get? Like what will I go with next? Okay, I got this stuff. I got from B Beauty Limited and this is a brand that sells Japanese cotton infused face masks. Now I got sent two of them to try out and I've already tried the pale face mask. The next one to try is the collagen one and I am very excited to try this out because the pearl face mask was amazing. My skin felt fantastic after it. It was glowing and I loved it. I was so impressed with the face mask and I had it says to leave it on for half an hour but I actually left it on for an hour because I didn't um what do you call it? I didn't time it and I ended up just playing the Xbox and I got carried away and then by the time I knew it it was an hour had gone past so I took it off but it didn't make a difference to my skin there was no reaction it felt amazing and that means I'm really excited to try the collagen one because I like collagen face masks put some bounce back into my skin anyway so that's from Be Beauty Limited so keep an eye out on the blog for a review coming very soon on these um, I also got blogger meal wise this I'm excited about because it smells fantastic 
at as T. T. Now, I'm pretty sure a lot of you will be thinking, T, you're excited about T? But I am excited about T. Um, it's T root, and there's red square. I got fruit tea, which is red square. Um, it's cranberry, hibiscus, and apple. And I got Magic Mountain, which is black tea, honey, lavender, cornflower and strawberry. So I'm excited about these. These are going to be going in my Christmas gift guide for unusual presents. Because I think this is maybe an unusual present that you would get someone. Because you wouldn't just think, oh, tea, and then get somebody tea. So I think this is definitely going to go in that Christmas gift guide. I'm going to try it out soon and I will let you all know how I get on with it. I'm really, really looking forward to the red square one because I think fruit tea is quite nice. Yeah, and it came in this little pack. I'm excited about that. Okay, that's another lot I got. What else did I get? Oh, okay. I got this. And then I'm going on to a bigger one because they're pretty cool. I got the case from Case App, which if you read my blog, you will have seen that I have already done a review on this. But this is it up close and I just wanted to show you it because it is absolutely beautiful. It is not on my phone at the moment because I have this one on as Leon was playing with my phone and I know if this falls, this is like silicone and it's just better grip for Leon as well so I had this one on my phone at the moment and now this one is going to be going on. That's from Case App and it is the matte finish and it's completely personalised. I would go check out my blog post on it though because there's all the information you really need there. I got that. Now I got these. Now I'm absolutely in love, 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 love with these gift sets and I cannot wait to put them in my gift set Christmas gift guide because wow, amazing, absolutely amazing. They are 100% honey, like 100% honey from bees, um, which I think that is an amazing ingredient to have in any kind of cosmetic for your like lips and stuff, um, and your skin, it is brilliant and I knew about Birch Bees before, but I really, I've only tried them once and it was a lip chap stuff and it was amazing. It was absolutely fantastic. So to be sent this from Fluorescent PR was amazing. Really, really nice of them to send and I cannot wait to put them in my gift guide. First up is the Naturally Nourishing Mango Set, which is, um, this is lip, Mango Lip Balm and the Ultimate Care Hand Cream by Birch Bees. It's a cute little set and look, it's like a little drawer and I love it. I think it's a really really cute gift set to get somebody, especially if somebody likes all natural things and their kind of cosmetic products or skincare. I think that is a perfect gift to get somebody. Now you have a smaller kind of gift set which is Birch Bees, it's a bit of Birch it's called and this is cuticle oil or cuticle cream and some moisturising lip balm. And it's so small and it's cute. I think it would be a really, really nice stocking filler for someone that likes like natural products. Even if they're not a big fan of like, well, not even a big fan, but maybe if they don't know a lot about natural products. And this is probably a good place for them to start because it, it's amazing. It really, really works. I've also got this one, which is the Burt's Bag of Treats. And it's a bigger one. Now I'm going to cut away because I can hear the little guy coming upstairs and I'll be back. Okay, so now I'm going to tell you about shoes from Just Fab that I got. I absolutely love them. They are a gorgeous design and when I picked them I did not think they were going to be as nice as they were in real life. This is the kind of details about them. Now, they were originally £54 but I do know on Just Fab site that for your first order you can get two for around £35 I'm sure but I think after that they go to one price and that so I think they would probably be £54 after that. Um, there was a deal on and you were getting your first pair of boots for £9 so yes, yes please I need new boots for the winter. I was actually looking for flats that when maybe went up to about knee length but I couldn't find any that I particularly liked and then I came across the, these little ankle boots and wow, I fell in love with them. thought these are going to be perfect 
for me to go to like maybe some events in, they, um, they look comfy, they're not too big a heel and they will complement a lot of my outfits. And these are what they look like. Ta-da! How lovely are these boots? Like seriously, they are gorgeous. The heel is not too big. It's got nice little detailing on the side. I'm not even sure what kind of material they are, but they're not suede or anything, they're not leather. So, but already I've got a little scuff mark on them because I am so silly. I was wearing these about the house um, just to kind of wear them in. This is a left foot. Now the left foot is very tight, I think, compared to the right foot. The right foot fits like a dream and I could wear it all day. Oh, like honestly, I could, I could wear it all day. I could walk about it all day. They're easy to walk in. It's very comfy. But the left foot, it's quite tight around this area. And I feel like it's pushing my bones together maybe. So I'm not really sure if that's something to do with my foot or the shoes. It's probably to do with the shoes, honestly. And I'm just I'm praying that I can maybe work them in a bit so that they don't feel like that and my feet fit comfortably in them because they are gorgeous little boots and the other one is really, really easy to walk in. Plus they will go with a lot of stuff that I'm going to be wearing this winter. Um, yeah, so I got these little ones. For about, they were just under £9 actually, but with delivery and postage and packaging included, it was £12.50 maybe, maybe just a bit over. There was no more than £13 anyway for these little boots and I think that is a fantastic price because they are gorgeous. The heel's not too big, they've got nice detail and they are going to do me really well over the next couple of months I think. And if I keep them in good condition probably a bit longer. So I think I'm going to go to Just Fab and buy a couple more pairs um, just because I think for the price as well it's quite good and my grand's not opened an account yet so I'll probably do that and get the two for 35 but yeah it's probably not the best thing to say but I probably will do that because I think it's a good idea. Anyway so they were just shy of £13 to get delivered. I think that's a fantastic price. So that's my boots from Just Fab. Um, next and probably last thing, I'm going on probably second last thing, is this that I got. Now it's just, I need shoe storage so bad. So what I was thinking about doing is maybe put my shoes under my bed, but then I don't want to get them all dusty. So I was thinking I need something that's going to kind of keep them, keep them kind of good, you know. But and then my gran found these for me. It is a little shoe box. The only thing is it's not got a lid or anything. So I mean dust will still get in but it will keep them in a lot better condition than what they would be if they were just shoved under my bed I think. They have this as well. Little pulley tab. Now I think this is probably for something in a wardrobe if I'm honest. I think that that's what this is meant to go in. It's meant to go in something or it's maybe you know where those hanging ones that you put on a door or something in your wardrobe and they slot in. I think that maybe that's what this is for um, but it didn't come with a pulley on it like a big thing. It didn't come with that on it. It just came with these and the pulley tab but yeah this will be perfect for going under my bed putting all my shoes in and I've got one two, three, four, five, I've got six of them so I have so that will make such a big difference I think in the quality like, of keeping my shoes in good condition and it's going to save me some space as well because in my walk-in wardrobe across the hall there is, it's just, it's a tap. I've got bags everywhere, I've got scarves everywhere, I've got shoes everywhere and I've got my chest of drawers with all my clothes in it as well and then I've got a big unit of all makeup and stuff and hair products skin products and I'll probably do a video on that actually because I mean I've got a lot of stuff and it is quite a big walk-in wardrobe if I'm honest. It's not actually a walk-in wardrobe it's an extra room we've got so we just turned it into a walk-in wardrobe slash storage area so I keep all the Christmas presents in there as well. We have a present box that we have where we put presents in throughout the year and then if somebody's birthday's coming up we know that we've got presents in there for them that sort of thing so yeah so it's a big kind of area and the boiler's in it so you can't use it as a room but it is big enough that you probably could use it as a room but we can't because the boiler is in it, in it and it's not enclosed or anything it's just kind of out and open and there's pipes going into the bathroom etc but it's, it's got good size so yeah i'll probably do a little video of that and it's 
totally messy and I need to clean it up so that is really going to help. Also, what else? Oh yes, yes, okay. Now, these flowers here, I'll just get rid of this because this is just... Okay, I'm not getting rid of that. Anyway, these are flowers that... My good friend Katie sent to me. How cute are these? Honestly, how lovely is this? Look at the little, it's a little cup with the handle and it's flowers and they're gorgeous and they smell absolutely beautiful. This was a lovely little surprise that I got last week from Katie. I wasn't feeling well, I was feeling quite down and rubbish and then I got a knock on the door and I thought it was actually my grand that had got keys but she didn't. It was a man who was delivering these to me and a teddy and chocolates and a card. Uh, wow, I was so thankful for it. I'll probably, after this little bit, I'll probably insert my reaction video because I didn't know who it was from and I was quite intrigued. So what i done is I just filmed my reaction to everything on Snapchat. Um, I hadn't opened any of it yet, so you see me open it in the, the, film, the video, obviously, and I just put everything on there to go along with so that people could just see and be as surprised as I am. And I was, I was genuinely not expecting it to be for Katie. I don't know who I was expecting them to be from, but Katie was not who I was expecting them to be from, and it was just such a nice gesture for her to do. It was a really, really nice thing that brightened up my day, made me so happy, and I was just, I was extremely thankful for them, if I'm honest. Yeah, they are beautiful in my opinion and I love that I have them sitting on my bedside table, proud of place, and I love them. So thank you so much Katie for that, oh no, now I'm spilling water everywhere. Yeah, I think that's, that's kind of it for this video. I'll maybe put some snippets of other things in. I'll also be putting a snippet of my reaction to this delivery and no, I think that's it. Yeah, it's not been a long vlog this one, I don't think. I hope so, until I edit all the, the, all the videos together and then it is quite a long vlog. Anyway, so this was my delivery from Katie. That was my blogger mail and my boots that I got from Just Fab and my new foot, like, shoe storage. Yeah. Anyway, thank you so much for watching my channel. Um, oh, I'm going to put these down, actually, before I do this. Anyway, thank you so much for coming to my channel. Thank you so much for watching this video. Um, if you liked it, give it a big thumbs up because that would be fantastic. Um, maybe subscribe. I've still not worked out where the subscribe button is going to be. I said that I was going to do that. I've still not worked it out. Yeah, thank you for coming. Keep coming back. Um, enjoy the videos, I suppose. Yeah, and my little guy totally enjoyed being on camera today and I'm so glad that I can put some bloopers in because I think that's just going to be really, really cute. We also filmed his room tour today and wow, he was very, very noisy, but we got it done, so that was good. Yeah, anyway, I am going to get ready and I am going to head out. So thank you so much for watching and I've said that a few times, so now I'm going to stop because it's getting awkward. But yeah, big thumbs up, maybe give it a comment, subscribe, you know, just anything keep coming back because I enjoy it. I enjoy seeing that people enjoy these videos, all the likes I've been getting, all the comments I've been getting and the views. It's amazing and I know it's nothing big that I'm getting but what I am getting is more than I expected to get. I thought I'd have like 10 views on a video and that would be it and like nobody would like them and nobody would comment on them. So all the comments, likes and shares and everything are absolutely amazing and thank you so much for being supportive and being one of my supporters if you are reading this and if you're not just become one because that'd be really really cool and follow me on twitter because i'm i don't know i like talking to people i could talk all day as you can see i'm rambling now anyway yes i could talk to people all day come follow me on twitter we'll chat we'll be best friends it'll be perfect okay but thank you for watching bye hi right, everyone i just wanted to do this on my snapchat because look at this look so, I'm feeling really, really sick today, and I've been in my bed. My gran and Leon are out, and I thought my gran had forgot her keys because we got a big chap at the door. But it wasn't my gran, it was some man delivering flowers, chocolates, and a teddy bear, and a card. I have no idea who this is from, 
and I'm about to open the card and I just wanted to do it here because I thought this would be a really really good idea. The card yet and this is me just going to open the card so bear with me and we'll find out who this is from. Okay I haven't opened the card yet but I've just found out that it's from here and and this is a flower shop right near my house maybe about 10 minutes away so it's got to be somebody I know I suppose now I get to open the card and see who these are from and now I'm extremely excited to find out who sent this amazing present. And here is the card. Okay, let's open it and see who it's from, shall we? <gasps> oh my god, no way! Okay, you have no idea, right? This is just so exciting. This is from Katie. Katie, my blogger friend. Oh my god! Katie, thank you so much because I know you're going to watch this and thank you. Jesus, Katie, this is amazing. I like, oh my, this is just, this is an amazing thank you. Like, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you.